and welcome to Field Sports World. A lot of people have asked over Instagram if we can do a review over the Sarko S20, which is great because Field Sports World have just bought me one. And here she is. Gunter, before I take this, this rifle shooting, can you explain a bit about it? Yes. Yeah, that, that's your new hunting gun. This is the Sarko S20. Very nice it looks too. Yeah, it's a, a combination of hunting and long range hunting gun. Okay. It looks not like the traditional hunting gun uh, and it looks not like a long range gun. Mm -hmm. It's uh, in between. Mm -hmm. You have an adjustable stock. You can adjust the comb, you can adjust the length with spacer here. Okay, for winter and summer shooting. For, for example. Yeah. And they have a, a very accurate barrel which is fluted. Yeah. It ends with an, a normal. Uh, 5, 8 by 24 muzzle thread and uh, you have a two piece stock on an alloy frame so you have a, a, a very accurate system mm -hmm. and for the grip or for, for, for using you have plastic synthetic parts front part and the back part and you have two different styles uh, of Backstock you mm -hmm. can uh, get from uh, Zarko, mm -hmm. and you have two different styles of front parts you can get. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the Sunwall one, and uh, the other one is the sports or match uh, uh, stock, mm -hmm. which has a no Sunwall and it's a little bit more heavy made. Mm -hmm. The other thing is, uh, which is very precision, is that they have a uh, Picatinny rail which is integrated into the action. It's milled in very low. And so you have no screws, no glued uh, rail. Oh, that's right, yeah, yeah. So it's completely integrated and uh, the best performance uh, you can get. Okay. You need a good scope mount and a good scope too. That's what we talk later. You have a very, very smooth working action. Zarko is a... Yeah, it is very smooth, yeah. yeah. Zarko is a company from Finland. They are this year 100 years old. Okay. And uh, they make very, very good and accurate barrels. Mm -hmm. They produce it by themselves. They make very good actions combined with a very very good trigger in the standard way trigger is very crisp this 16 700 gram of trigger pull yeah you've changed it for us yeah you? for yeah. for your gun we changed it uh, and you have now a trigger pull like under 1000 gram very crisp you can try it yeah. And changing the trigger pull, you would always recommend to take it to a gunsmith to get the yeah, trigger pull. Yeah, that's, that's the best way and the safer way. Very, very yeah. crisp. Very crisp, very light, yeah. It's not a lightweight gun and it's not a heavy gun. No. Uh, it's yet in this side heavy with this kind of scope. That's the scope you have in your business, mm -hmm. uh, which you used before on another gun. We put it with the uh, Red Nagel technical mount. Uh, on this gun, this is an uh, Atlon scope. It comes from America. It's uh, powered 4.9 by, uh, by 29. Uh, yeah, it's very accurate. It has good lenses, very good uh, click, very good uh, uh, reticle adjustment. Uh, so we used your uh, uh, scope which you have before to put it on the gun. Same with the silencer. Mm -hmm. We have a very very good silencer here, made from the German company Rodale. <laughs> it's a um, uh, Titan uh, printed silencer, very very uh, high quality. Not the cheapest one, but uh, a long life silencer mm -hmm. and a very very good. Uh, Noise adjust uh, absorption. And the Rodale we've got uh, is fitted. We've got a quick mount on there. 
the, the, this one, I can show it uh, later on the other guy. I have yeah. second S20 with me. Okay. Uh, there we have a quick mount uh, system uh, with an other side. This is traditional. Like traditional screwed. Screw. Okay. Yeah. yeah. As I say, that we put this scope onto this rifle. The rifle is a 6.5 Creedmoor. Yeah. I've never had a 6.5 Creedmoor. Yeah, that, that, that's the new upcoming caliber for long range hunting too. Okay. Very good precision, very, very good uh, penetration in, fr in front. It's a, it's a wild ball, it's a roebuck. Okay. And uh, all the feedback I get from this caliber is very good. Okay, as I say, I've never used it before. I myself have heard very good things about the 6.5. I've also heard bad things about the 6.5. I can't wait to try it out. We will talk in some weeks when you have... Yeah, we'll talk in some weeks, definitely, yeah. yeah. As I say, I can't wait to get it on the range, do a fit when we can, get a few yeah. test shots down, and then within, I think in the next two weeks, I'm gonna be going hunting with it, and I just yeah. can't wait. So you said that there's a change in the fore end here. Yeah, I have another one okay. with me. Here we have uh, the S20 with a different type of forehand. This is uh, a forehand which has a metal part here in front with the m -lock system. So you can uh, mount the Catini rail or an adapter for, for example, this Javelin uh, magnetic heat bipod. The, the bipod we talked about last week, didn't we, by Guntur? Yes, yes. Okay. It's the last uh, uh, gun talk. We had some stuff from uh, uh, Javelin 2, like the three leg bipod uh, mm -hmm. for uh, uh, hunting. This is a small one for hunting or sport shooting. They make different type of interested uh, equipment for. And Javelin, you mean by Javelin, you mean Spartan? Yeah. Okay, it's my first part. Yeah. So this is a different uh, point. Uh, I think if you hunt some weeks with your gun, uh, you will have this too. Yeah. Because it's uh, uh, very, very good if you want to combine with the uh, Atlas uh, uh, bipod or a Javelin bipod or whatever. Mm. Here we have a uh, silencer, the same we, we talked uh, in the last uh, gun talk. Yeah. It's a swim core. It's, uh, Norway Vegan Company 2. Yeah, yeah, I can remember it from last week. Yeah, it's a very light one, it's very, very effective. It's uh, inside with uh, Titan 5. And this is a quick lock system. Yeah, that's it. Quick you you put it on, you have to tighten it uh, strong, and it works. So, scope on top. Yeah, here we, we, we take uh, uh, the Leica PRS scope. It's not a really hunting scope, it's a, a combination for long range hunting scope or for long range shooting. shooting. It's not a real uh, 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 hunting scope. scope, scope. Yeah. It does look like a long range uh, yeah. scope. <laughs> it's, it has a, a magnification uh, from 5 to 30 yeah. uh, with a 56 uh, millimeter lens. Which is very high and but very good uh, uh, turrets mm. where you can grip it very very good mm -hmm. with gloves too. Yeah. And here's the the, the uh, Recknagel tactical mount too. On your gun, it's a two-piece mount. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit lighter from the weight than the mount, it's the one-piece mount, uh, which we use here. Okay. I mean, like are a very good quality scope. Yeah. I mean, kind of Every time for me a smile to look through a Leica yeah. because the quality, the brightness, the clear, clearness is fantastic. Okay. Good Gunter. Um, as I say, I can't wait until I take this rifle out, or our rifle, which is to one side. Yeah. Um, and I will get back to you as soon as I can and let you know yeah. how we get on. I, I hope to hear your feedback uh, for the gun and for the caliber. <laughs> Don't worry, I will. If you would like to know more about the Sarko S20 or anything else we spoke about in this gun talk, then please click below.